Hi there, this is Debbie from Stamps and Stuff, and I'm going to show you this cute little quick card to use some of those little scraps that you have hiding in the bottom of your drawers. So basically what we want to do is we just want uh, inch and a half scraps like this cut into squares, and you want them to color coordinate. This paper that I'm using is an old piece of Bow Bunny that I had uh, left over. So now what we're going to do is this is an eight and a half by five and a half sheet that I have creased and then I have run the top through an embossing folder just like this and you just run it right through like this. So this is the base of my card. I have a purple sheet that's three and three quarter by four and a quarter and a white sheet that's three and a half by four and a quarter and I have stamped the sentiment happy birthday. Let's see, I think I'll put it right about like yay. Okay, now what I did with uh, the squares is I took and with a half inch corner rounder, I cut the diagonal corners. You don't want to cut all of them. You want to cut two that are on the diagonal. Okay, now I'm going to take our Tim Holtz Distressed Ink and I'm using Barn Door and what I'm going to do is I'm going to ink up these edges so that gives them a little bit of dimension and also what I do is you're going to put all the square edges in the center so you're 90 degree angles will go in the center as you put this together. But when you ink this up, it will have just a little bit more dimension to it. with it. And this one I'm going to put on the top or leave it off depending on what I think at the time. Okay, now then what I'm going to do here is I'm going to start in this corner in this one. I have foam tape on the bottom and I'm going to lay these right about here and secure them in with their foam tape and the ones at the bottom and then so you can see how this looks it's cute like that or you can add one in like this so it's just I think I'll leave one like this and we'll have one of each Okay, then what I did on the inside of this card here is I went ahead and I took a four inch by five and a quarter and I embossed it with the same embossing folder and then I took my ink just a little bit and I just ever so lightly just kind of rubbed it around the edges so it will pick up the edges of the design and give it a little bit more definition there. So anyway, hope you enjoyed that. Get out your scraps and you can email me at t underscore o'neill at frontiernet.net. Uh, I'd be happy to upload your designs, your card designs in one of our card galleries. And again, check out our website. Love to see you there. Thanks.